Yeah, because I went to church since I was little. So. Yeah. And it says it in the Bible. Yes, but um, in the in the Hindu sacred scriptures, it says something different, doesn't it? Yeah, but they're brought up to believe that one. Then it yes. Was it. So you mean everybody should just believe what they're brought up to believe, even though it, they contradict each other? Yeah, but people change when they get older. Like some people will convert from being Hindu to Christianity. Or from so Christianity to being Hindu. Yeah. Yes. And you're you're happy about that, are you? Yeah. Okay, it's a very satisfied position to be in. Um, yeah. Keep that one again, but it was related to evolution. And the science, yes. The science. Uh, if you were to ask me why I believe what I believe, which is evolution, the very last thing I would say is because I was brought up to believe it. Absolutely the last thing I would say. I would say the reason I believe it is because here is the evidence. And I would say here's a book of evidence, and here's another book of evidence, and here's another book of evidence. And you can go and look at fossils, you can go and look at DNA evidence. You can look at the evidence of the geographical distribution of animals and plants. That's evidence. Saying that it says so in my holy book, what kind of evidence is that? Does anybody seriously think that, that the evidence of a book that was written a few hundred thousand years ago by somebody who obviously didn't know anything, how could they know anything in those days? You're seriously saying that you take that more seriously than the evidence of fossils, the evidence of DNA, the evidence of geographical distribution, the evidence of comparative anatomy, comparative physiology. Does anybody really want to defend that position?